What's up guys, this is Cyan879, back from more Dinosaurs 8, and the Lubu story, so last time we just uh, killed Dong Zhuo, and now we are ended up, we ended up here. So as of recording this video, I got a spanking new uh, Xbox One controller for my PC, which is quite nice, looks very good, and it works pretty well. So for this battle of Ching Shan, I think we are going to be Zhang Zhang Liao, just something new. Because all the other times we've been Lu Bu, so we'll do something new. And I still think I can get the job done. It's in Zhang Liao, who's at level 83. And I won't even put, uh... Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll put the defense boost. I can get the job done with him. Victory on the battlefield is worth any cost. Yep. Alright, let's go talk to these people. Hello, Lubu. What do you got to say? Although he's a fool, he really intends to win this battle. He's in luck. I've been waiting to get in the, out there and fight. It's good to see you so excited about combat. I, sh I too shall indulge myself with this battle. I still cannot get over why Master Lubu would side with the likes of Wan Xiao. I like how you say that like right in front of him. Master Jing Liao is a man of few words. I am surprised that he didn't let out a single complaint during all this. However, I'm certain he bears the same feelings as Master Lubu does. Am I wrong? I like how they like talk about it like right in front of them. It's Wee Exu and I think Song Jian. So defeating Dong Zhuo means serving Wan Xiao. I'm sure Master Lu Bu will be most displeased. Oh, it's Cheng Lian. Master Lu Bu possesses great strength, but he lacks strategists who can put it to good use. If only we can find them. Oh, the search for the strategist. Oh, who are you, Yan Liang? No, Gao Gan. You should be grateful that Lord Wan Xiao has agreed to accept you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. You could talk to that guy all the way over there, but I don't care. Alright, what do you got to say? Our forces are set out are to set out and destroy Zeng Yan. There's no mercy for those who tarnish the Wan name. I don't know how we tarnished him. I am indebted to you, it shall be done. Very good. Now if only Lu Bu Shu would be the same respect. My lord, please pardon his insolence. Fine, but just this once, I have ex high expectations of you two. You will not be disappointed, I assure you, my lord. My army shall attack from he is the so nice. And strike down See, we don't get we don't get red hair like Lubu does. I want you to take those bandits and Gong Sun Zan's army. And for some reason, the maps do that. There it goes. You must repay the courtesy of being treated as guests through our efforts in battle. I am ready to take to the field. Come on, what are you waiting for? Yeah, that guy died pretty quick. Hello, Lubu. All right, so what you want to do? Don't think you um. You do want to follow Wan Xiao, but let me just do this real quick. Alright. You want to follow Wan Xiao. It's like very imperative that you do, because for one, he's one of the commanders. Two, um, you have to do actually something for him, so... Yeah. We've been waiting for you! Now, release the boulders. So just ignore what they're telling you over there. You're supposed to uh, save one shell. Oh. If you're Lu Bu, this is much easier because you can just follow one shell around. I don't even think you have to defeat the guys on the bottom. Yeah, they took care of them. Open the gates. I would like to thank you personally for helping. All right, so yeah. Next, we shall advance through the center and strike the enemy main camp. All units, follow my lead. So those guys in the south should be fine. Master Yuan Shao's march is rather impetuous. We should proceed with caution. The Lu is just going right into the middle on his own. Alright, well, so much for our guys being able to take care of things while we're gone. I don't know why they're having so much... There's not even... There's one guy down there. One freaking guy! I have to keep one shell safe, so if those guys die, they die, so... Yeah, you definitely want to follow one shell in this battle, like I said previously. Uh, it's required for the hypothetical path later. 
I don't know where Lubu is going. Where is Lubu going? Oh, did he actually go to where we're actually going? Stupid unit commander. One one shout, it's taking forever. I have failed. God damn it, we do. You. You. you suck! See, he fled. He didn't even get killed by a general. So useless. And this is what this is the one thing I dislike about this game. Is that generals will just die to freaking ordinary troops. Like seriously. In the previous games, they didn't die to ordinary troops. Usually they got killed by getting ganged up about ganged up on by like multiple generals or one particular strong general or if they had low morale, one general. But at least it was always from one general. Now is there nobody who can provide me with a decent job? Even if there's uh, just regular troops there, they uh, they freaking die. All right, Lubu, I got you. All right, I think I defeated him uh, here. Yeah, let's, let's take care of him. All right, you can stop hitting him. He's dead. Yes, I'm sure. All right, so we rescued him for a second time. Everybody, advance in the name of my glorious army! Uh, I'm gonna wait and see if I can go kill these guys. That the enemy is through with their tactics. We must continue to remain vigilant. Let's see what these guys are up to. Are you actually gonna kill this guy? Don't yeah, think okay. you've won this battle yet. All units, our target is Yuan Shao's main camp. Yuan Shao's main camp. The enemy is attempting to head straight for our main camp. I am not about to let them succeed. Finally, they killed him. Alright, so I'm gonna go over here. I don't know if they're gonna jump off that, that cliff right there. Yeah, they are. Damn it. Alright. Just do. That. I don't know why these guys actually were more um, allied with Zinya, yeah, not just these vassals. All right, all right. Now I'm gonna quickly go uh, join up with Wan Shao. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is just moving around. At least now our units are actually moving forward. Now I think all the rest of our generals are worth one show. I think. Yeah, they are. Do not mistake my current position. I'm simply giving you time to come in and finish them off. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I should have eliminated all the enemies first. That way, all these generals were that actually like came up and followed us. So maybe yeah, if you were uh, watching this, yeah, I follow that. Just eliminate all the guys around the main camp quickly and then follow watch out because you should have time maybe depends on how overpowered you are i probably could have done it but it might be best if you just eliminate a few of them half of them so yeah your mileage will vary very boring waiting for one shot to advance come on one shot Hurry up. Get the next, uh, oh, there we go. It was wise for us to hide you. Call in the reinforcements. We will strike the enemy down. That's funny, his Gong Tsung Zan is already dead. I am Xiao Yu. Officer Gong Tsung Zan. This battle is as good as over. Oh, I'm sure it is. Oh, 
that guy. Hello, Joey. Ow. Not nice. Now, come and face my spear. He fights with such spirit and vigor. He is clearly worthy of the name Dragon. It would be an honor to face him in that battle. That We must head to the aid of our allies. Forward! Our enemy is led by Yuan Shao and Liu Bu. Oh no! Haha! <laughs> Even Gong Su Zan falls before us. The might of Liu Bu's army is a sight to behold. Witness my might. And they're they're grateful. It's quite a spectacle. I think that means we did this thing right. The enemy camp lies straight ahead. All units advance. It depends on how the next uh, ending scene goes. So we'll see if I actually did it. I'm pretty sure I did, but you never know. I could have been too far away from Wan Chao or something. Great as always. There was no need for my strategy. What's up, guys? All right. So now basically all you got is a bunch of mobile unit captains. Whoopee. Unfortunately, we're not Zuzu, so we're probably not going to get a thousand kills. But you know, we'll at least get most of these kills on the horse. Zing Yan has a lot of troops. For being a freaking band of leader. It's an interesting map though. And it just went completely around. What's up, Zing Yan? I'm pretty sure we saw you in uh, the Cow Cow story where you were part of the old tournaments, but now you're up here. Where you're historically supposed to be. Yes, this is more historical. That is not. He did not die like that. He didn't die at all. He just. Hmm. He actually didn't. Have, Insect. He had a battle, but he mostly just retreated. This battle bores me. No matter how many times I might fight it. In that case, perhaps it's time that we. Lubu, hmm. I was most impressed with your efforts. Your might is without equal in this land. What do you say? Would you like to become an official officer in my army? <laughs> I'm through with you. Hmm. I'll fight my own battles from now on. In that case, remember this. When you require the power of the nobility to help fight your battles, I, Yuan Shao, will be right there. We nobles always pay our debts without fault. That means we got it. I'm pretty sure. Ha! Huh. I'll be sure to remember that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what he's supposed to do. Lu Bu defeated Zheng Yan at the Battle of Mount Chang and helped deliver victory to Wan Shao. However, it was not a victory that he could take satisfaction in. Giving up on Wan Shao, Lu Abu set out with Zheng Liao's under once again to begin a life of wandering from place to place. Meanwhile, impressed by Lu Bu's fighting ability, Wan Shao proposed an alliance with him. That is what you need. It's exact, that's what you want. Afterwards, a messenger came to visit the wandering Lu Bu. The messenger informed Ka Lu Bu of Cao Cao's absence from Pu Yang and that he should seize it for himself. In addition, the messenger's master was determined to help Lord Lu Bu and would be waiting for him at Pu Yang. This was the perfect opportunity for Lu Bu, who still had no land to call his own. Lu Bu had always been motivated by his ability to seize whatever he wanted through sheer strength. He made up his mind and headed for Puyang, where the leader of the messenger Chen Gong was waiting for him. Lu Bu, Chen Gong, Zheng Liao, 
This group of men sent out set out for the battlefield determined to realize their destiny. Alright guys, we got the capture Pu Yang next. I will see you guys for that. Thanks for watching.